Good afternoon, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Saturday Grab Bag in our first stream of 2021. Um, let's do a little, little LTTP rando. Because I wanted to do an LTTP rando. Um, this should be fun. A normal open key sanity defeat Ganon. Uh, randomized crystals. We're gonna go with the Hollow Knight sprite today, because I just discovered it was in the list. So, uh... We're gonna see how it goes. We're gonna see if it Fs up any of our uh, bomb jump lineups or whatever we need to do with it, so. Whew, all right, let's get this going in three, two, one, go, 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 go. Let's go. It's, it's a rando. That's a pretty looking sprite, isn't it? Okay, we got a key to Thieves Town. What a not great start. <laughs> Weirdo frame rate going on here. Uh, I need to pause and, and work this out. All right, hold on a second. Why is it being so shitty on the frame rate? I guess this is because Twitch was having problems earlier today. I wonder if they yet worked that out. what I did, but that's better. Okay, all right. Resume. Unpause timer, let's go. Very weird. Oh, I forgot to grab the thing to do the... <laughs> the thing to do the guard kill to get the tree pulled. Damn, now they are wrecking my shit. Ouchie! Stop. Lord. Please. Uh, uh, <laughs> Alright, we gonna get the tree pull out of this yet? Maybe, maybe not. Keep an eye on my frame right here. I don't know why it was so weird before. Compass! To Misery Mire. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. That's a very dark sprite, isn't it? Okay. Well, oh, that was Sankart right there, too. A bomb drop? No, no bomb drops. No bomb drops for us today, it seems. Unfortunate. What are you gonna do? Okay. 50 bucks, though. Be good for, uh... Bomb purchase if we need it later. Which we may or may not need, because we've got zero drops of good stuff here. Wow, that's a weird carry animation. <laughs> okay. So, like, this Hollow Knight sprite is, uh... is interesting so far, shall we say. My goodness. No, like, are we... I don't know what the tiered tree pulls are yet. Okay, so I guess we've only got the one in the heart drops. What about the crab drop, though? Oh, bombs. Hey, there we go. That's good. Give me all of them bombs. Grab another set of them on the way through the Lost Woods. Jack, we've got 50 bucks. All right, so we don't give a shit about Lumberjack. We're gonna hope we can continue not giving a shit about it and hope that we don't need to do Ego 1. Because that would be something. Wonderful, but not have to worry about. Right, let's grab the remainder of our bonds here. Thank you. And a small key of a mushroom. What do we got there? Swamp. Okay, so we've got 
two of the unique small keys already. We've got the one to Thieves Town and the one to Swamp. Uh, Sir, excuse me. Put your butt under that bush. And then we got another small key to Skull Woods. That one. I don't really care about those too much. I think just having one of those is probably fine. But knowing our luck, we'll see like two or three more of them. Because why not? For now. The three, possibly four for Kakariko, and we should be able to do the rest of South Shore with the remaining six. If we are frugal. It's candy. Ten arrows, woohoo. A big key. Tahara. Interesting. And another small key to skull with. Okay, we don't need any more of those, please. Not required. My heart container ain't bad. Still, a little bit lacking on the equipment. Aside from the fortuitous bomb drop from the crab. Candy, I think that makes two. Fifty bucks, alright, so we are definitely covered for bottle vendor. Our container, sure. Twenty buckos. And a big key to pod. Okay. <laughs> okay, a little bit too early to be seeing that one. But that's alright. 100 bucks gets us the Moon Pearl. All right. There's some value, finally. Half the chicken clip there. Another heart container. Okay, well, you know, early health is nice. I won't say no to it. I prefer some weaponry or something. But, you know, work with what we get here. It's candy, that'll be three of four. So based on the lack of things we've gotten so far, probably just going straight through to race game is going to be the thing to do. Don't bother checking it, just go for it. But let's see what's in the library first. Our container. Don't, ne don't necessarily need that. If I'm passing through later with the boots, I might grab it, but considering we're already at seven hearts, not seven minutes in here, I feel too bad about leaving that one behind. And, oh, uh, that's some green goo. And that'll be our first bottle as well, so we could truck back up to Sick Kid and be like, hey, let's see this bottle of snot I got. Give me what you got now. I guess we will do that. I guess afterwards we'll head to South Shore. Six bombs should be just enough. We'll need, let's see, one, two, three, four, at least four for Mini Moldorn Cave. Ah, just a piece of heart. Okay, well, that's good for the refill and the extra heart container, so whatever. Uh, we'll need at least four for Mini Moldorn Cave, possibly five, if we're being efficient. And we'll have our sixth for Ice Rod Cave. But who knows, maybe we'll pick up a... A triple on the way and be a bit more covered, just in case something goes wrong. As things things can go wrong, they will. Pretty sure Hyrule has its own version of Murphy's Law, right? 
20 bucks. Thanks for now. Well, I guess it's not nothing. It's literally 20 bucks. But thanks for a figurative nothing. <laughs> hey, Firetron. How you doing? Thanks for the resub. Much appreciated, much appreciated. Oh, a burrito, sure. We'll grab a burrito, since they're actually sort of useful now. Or G-Tower. <laughs> Never mind, that one sucks. <laughs> one of the most worthless burritos. Can't believe it. Oh, actually, what I might want to do is get some more bombs. Yeah, there we go. I might go back and grab that fish, just because. Oh wait, did he? Oh no, he's right there. Okay. Wait, what happened to him? Did the bird steal that fish? Oh, you a-hole bird. All right, well, whatever. Yeah, more bombs. That's good enough, I guess. Now this time we don't need to be quite so frugal with our bombs. Still, won't stop me from using them in a frugal fashion. Candy. Another big key. Skull woods. Oh boy, a hammer! There we go. That's better. A form of weaponry we have now achieved. Permanent weaponry. Alright. Let's go knock out Ice Rod Cave. Might hit front of escape. Uh, that's probably the densest of plays we could do. We could go to Sahash in front of Eastern if we cared that much about it. Which I don't care that much about it. <laughs> it's not a bow and or boots or something, right? But we'll see where this gets us. I like the idea of doing Dark Cross without, like, a sword or something. Now we got a small key to T-Rock. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Alright, front escape. At least three. We'll decide on the way down if we want to try Dark Cross. With a just hammer and a pack of bombs, I guess. But that's going to be kind of rough. On top of not being in love. But we'll see. We'll see what we can do here. Maybe we'll luck out and get three swords and escape. <laughs> I'd be okay with that. In fact, we're actually only one item away from uh, Dark World access, too. We just need a glove. Money. Just need a glove, then we've got Dark World. Which is good. I would put... Uh, Ega one firmly in the rear view mirror. Big key to T Rock, okay. It's a small key and a big key to T Rock. Uh, not terribly thrilled about that. So that's the first one. We got two more. We've got this chest on the right here. Excuse me, sir. And then Zelda's cell, former cell, I suppose. Ah, hey, a bow. Isn't that interesting? Okay. That makes me look towards Eastern now. Go East, young man, and all that. Okay, that probably means I'm not going to bother with Dark Cross. Nice heat pop drop there. Small key to T-Rock. Okay. Alright, not bad. Not bad. We are now getting equipped up with cool shit. 
hammer and bow is a nice set of pawns to have. I wouldn't mind a, a pointy stick, though. Even just a little plastic sword from the start would be, uh, be okay. Excuse me, sir. But let's see. We've got... Sahashrila Eastern. This be three, up to, well, more than six. Up to nine, I guess, items, considering Key Sanity is a lot. Let's see how many we can pull out of here. Oh, we don't have the big key. Oh, wait, we don't have the big key to Eastern. Duh. <laughs> Dope. Well, well, there's our glove. And, uh, and a boomerang. All right. So, that opens up the, the dark world for us. I think we shall do that. We'll start from the south this time. I usually don't go from the south, but I think it's a bad idea. Give it a try. Start with Hype Cave. Do some of the south dark world checks. Stumpy and dig game and all that, and then we could make our we could make our way up to, uh, to pod as well because we do have yeah we've got the big key to pod. But we don't have any small keys, so we'd have to potion glitch, which is fine. Oops, what am I doing? Uh, hype cave is what we're doing first here. Oh, I didn't talk to Saha for uh, the green pendant hint there either. Oops. Ah well. Hey, blue mail. Sick. Compass to T-Rock. Oh boy. Piece of candy. Good refill. Another piece of candy. And another compass. <laughs> to Ice Palace. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Alright, well, the blue mail's pretty good there. Blue mail, nine hearts. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Let's check on the five sixers here. Just for some information. Eastern and Thieves. Okay. Eastern and Thieves. Five Sixers. Alright, well, hmm. It's the Stumpy and Dig Game. I guess we'll have to save and quit out again, or we could walk all the way back. There's another big key. To get G Tower, wow, alright. 16 minutes in, we've got G Tower big key. Nice, 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 nice. We'll take that. I suppose we will. We'll either save and quit out and go immediately back to Dark World so we can check the pyramid. And then catfish, and then maybe go into front of pod. Potion glitch the right side, etc., etc. Wow, I didn't realize how little money I had there. So we might stick around here and get some more scratch. If uh, Digging Game sees fit to give us some. Probably not even gonna make our money back here. Unless we dig up a 3 hundo. Get any more cash here? <laughs> nope. All right, we might have made back our money, possibly a little bit less, but all right. Um, yeah, I don't know. Save and quit out. It's probably about the same amount of time. But... This will get us Pyramid, this will also get us info on how many crystals we need to beat Ganon. Anywhere from 0 to 7, I'm hoping for the low end. Our most recent seeds have been pretty well balanced, on average. The last time was 5 and 5. It was slightly above average, but not awful. We don't have anything that uses magic, so our potion glitch is not going to work here. Alright. Might have to reconsider. 
I have to reconsider. Let's reconsider the uh, pod play we had in mind then. Got literally nothing that uses magic. It's unusual at this point. Even just a lamp would be nice. Can't do the potion glitch without using the potion, and that's green potion. We need to use magic. Speaking of. Alright, what do we got? Six. Ah, that's a lot. <laughs> that is too many crystals. Oh, and a flute on the pyramid. Well, I'm glad I came back here. Heck yeah. Well, that doesn't get us many new spots, but it does give us fast travel. So whilst we're here, whilst we're in this corner of the Dark World, let's go bother a fish. Give us an item. Hit box, please. Wow. Lots of full magic refill drops. Lots of magic drops in general. I guess that's good. We had something to actually make use of it. Mm hmm. Well, yeah, alright. Top it up on bombs, I guess. Alright, well, let's go activate the old flute. Or do back of escape. Do back of escape first. Uh, but we can't get to Dark Cross because we don't have the small key. So, but, I mean, all the more reason. Higher likelihood of there actually being three items back here instead of a map and a small key. That would be present in non Sandy. See what we got. Clippers, arrows, and a small key to Misery Mire. Oh boy. Clippers is good. We like that. Puts Zora squarely into logic. I don't necessarily like that because we are a little bit tight on the cash. But eh, we'll pick some up as we go. Does get a Zora ledge. Waterfall wishing hobo. Etc. Even though we could have just fake clippered for all of that, but with a extremely early moon pearl. But whatever. Let's just activate our flute. We might head right into dark world. Do we have? We don't have the big key to, to uh, the sense. Unfortunate. But we could hit dark world. We could hit. Front of Skull Woods, at least. And then, uh, And then probably front of Thieves. Gives us a few locations and hopefully give us some time to build up some cash. Since we're headed back into Dark World, Nine Hearts, Blue Mail. That's good. That's a nice, comfortable amount of health and defense to have. Wouldn't say no to red mail or a few more hearts, but at this point, I'm not going to go out of my way to get either of those. small key? We've got two small keys, and the big key. Do this right from this corner here. Nice. 
Boy, one of the single rupees. Perfect. Exactly what we need to see when we are a little bit cash poor here. Hey, there's slightly more money. Let's say, is that going to be enough to get me there? Hmm. Ah, nuts and gum. All right, well. <laughs> okay, let's just wiggle our way out of there. Take a quick death, get some, uh... Well, we don't even need to do that, actually. We can just, uh, do this the normal way, perhaps. Instead of doing bomb jumps and shit, right? Fine, we'll go out the normal way. Little bastard. Just didn't want to get buffed before we got to this next entrance over here. Because that has happened before more than once. Interesting. Okay, you know what? I actually am gonna just take the pop out of here. Let's see what the death animation is too. Ah, oh wow, that's yeah, that's pretty true to life of Hollow Knight, isn't it? It's nice. Hey Alex the Traveler, how you doing? Let's see you. Alright, so we're not gonna worry about that back half there. We don't got the fire rod to get any further. But powder is interesting. That does actually put Batman on the table. Not much else, though, unfortunately. Oh, does it put Batman on the table? Yeah, it does. Okay, good, 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 good. <clears throat> Alright, let's check out Bumper Ledge. Ten arrows, no thanks. Can't really do much else around here, can we? What's that? Oh. Yeah, okay. Uh, no, because we don't have the mirror to do either of these, so I guess off to Thieves Town. Which we've only got the small key to, so just the front side of Thieves Town, I guess. Ghost tried to juke me out of there. So three items in a Village of Outcast itself, starting with Sea House and the front side of Thieves Town. 
Small key to G tower, okay, whatever. I don't really need one of those. Since we've already got the big key. Bombable shed here or the brewery, whatever. I don't know what you want to call it. Alright, there's some cash. Let's suit our Zora play later on. Just a few more left. Excuse me, sir. 28 more buckos, then we'll make our way up to Zora. Well, plus whatever we're gonna lose here, right? Well, hey. There we go. And a big key to Ice Palace. Interesting. Interesting. All right, so now we're only eight buckos off here. Front side four here, we got 20 bucks, all right. There's the rest of our Zora money. Burrito to Meyer. Pass. Gotcha. Mm, got bunny beam there. Let's, uh, ah, <laughs> it's the shade form. I love it. I love it. Three, we get a hook shot. <laughs> Hello. Okay. I like that. And a bean a bottle. Don't like that quite as much. But the hook shot is awesome. Let's take the quick bop here. A little bit of health back. I don't know that there's anything else we can actually do in Dark World right now, is there? Nope. So we may as well just S and Q out. And then go up to... You know what? Let's go up to... The mountain. Since we now have access to East Death Mountain with that hook shot, it's nice. bit treacherous to navigate with just... Okay, so that was the room transition there. Oh, well, there's the hole. <laughs> I found the hole! As we always do. Okay, we should be good there. That should be there, yep. Alright. Should be exiting shortly. For 20 bucks, and I bet, yeah, of course the dead rock would block us off here. You shit. <laughs> Come on. Can't dodge cabbages all day here. Ouch. Alright. Well, we'll check up top and inside spec rock real quick. Ouch. And then over to east side Death Mountain we go for even more goodies, I hope. All right, up top, 100 bucks. Don't care. Inside, 20 bucks. Care even less. All right, that's all right. That's good. That's good. Um, ooh, this is interesting because we've got both the big. Oh no, we got the big key to Hera. So once we make our way up there, go take care of some business. And oh my God, that cabbage out for blood. Um, in the hopes that Hera is a crystal. It would be nice. It would be quite nice. Since we do have the gear to beat it, um, the only problem being that we would be leaving behind the basement. So we do not have a fire source. Or the small key to get down there. 
Small key to Hyrule Castle. Oh, hey! Never mind on that fire source. There's our fire rod. Excellent. Small key to ice, a burrito. Hero Castle, thanks for that. 20 buckos. More bombs. And 10 arrows, alright. <clears throat> Aside from the fire rod, kind of a, a bust up here, huh? Oh! It's not over far enough, huh? Yeah, that's a bummer. Alright, no biggie. around and not get bopped by these tectites, thank you. We've got Spiral Cave and Hera. I guess we'll go do Hera first, considering. Oh, don't you even. <laughs> don't you even. Oh, no! <laughs> okay. Be nice and safe about that. are really trying. Uh, <laughs> get out of here. Get. <laughs> really trying to get me there. Oh, I didn't check what was on the island either. We'll get that on the way back. Okay, so we don't have the small key. We're still leaving that one in the basement behind. Bummer. Bucks there. Nice. Just a bad secret hint there. Uh, bombs. You know what? I'm gonna take the bop there to get some health. Here's hoping Hera is a crystal, and or has some good stuff upstairs. Probably not gonna succeed. I'm gonna go for it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> cool. Alright, yep. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's good. Can I even. Okay. <laughs> it's like, can I even get out of here? Alright, never mind. So we won't try the bomb jump again. Apparently very bad at lining that up without a sword. Well, speaking of swords, excellent. Obtained sharp stick. Oh, okay. my blue mail as well. Oh. 
GPs. <clears throat> For trouble, we get 20 bucks. And please be a crystal. All right, it's a crystal. We know it's a normal one because Eastern and Thieves Town are the five sixers. All right, so not bad, not bad. 38 minutes in, 38-ish minutes in. Crystal number one, we'll need at least five more. At least five more and that's a pretty good chance of getting us everywhere we need to go. <clears throat> Unless G Tower turns out to be the full seven, which would be, ugh, yeah. Whatever, all right, looks like just a piece of candy up there. <clears throat> so spiral cave we go. go back and do the rest of Skull Woods, <clears throat> since we just picked up the fire rod. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Small key to G-Tower. Mm -hmm. I need any more of those. Ouch. Well, actually, unless G-Tower is uh, zero or one crystals or something, then progress could actually be in there. Uh, do I need to be up on the mountain anymore? I don't think I do. Alright, so before we head back to Skull Woods, let's go ahead and do Zora and etc. So Hobo, we can check the island. Um, then we can go up to Zora, which will be two in the waterfall, one on the Zora ledge, and one on Zora itself. A piece of candy on the island. Hobo, what she got for us today? A compass, gee thanks. Now we know where the boss is, so swan. Hmm. Not terribly useful there. But, that check's done now, so we don't need to worry about it no more. Hmm, I guess technically Dark Cross is in Logic 2 now, isn't it? Since we've got the Yieldy Fire Rod. I don't like that. Despite the fact that we could probably very easily go get it. Oh, we've got a sword to kind of find our way, and we could <clears throat> light us some torches if we need to. But, first things first. Tune the waterfall. 20 bucks, and bombs. Thanks for nothing. Shovel on the ledge. Okay. Fetch quest ho. Or fetch quest shovel, depending on your choice of digging implement. And for the exorbitant amount of 500 buckos, we get <clears throat> 50 in return. <laughs> Thanks. Boy, howdy. I love a 10% ROI. Garbage ass fish. Alright, so why don't we just go turn in that shovel right away? Get it off our minds. The. Just about, well, we can go over and do uh, <clears throat> Batman as well. And then maybe check Agina and uh, Desert Ledge. Just get the remainder of our overworld checks done that we can do. <laughs> Magic Bat first, I guess.
we are graced with a burrito. Thanks for Hera. Oh boy. Worthless, because we've already cleared Hera. Alright, well, thanks for nothing on that one. Quest number dose here. Shovel comes. Piece of candy. That should be another refill in a heart. No? That counts off. But... <clears throat> okay. Nothing there. Last overworld checks we've got are the desert ledge. It's 20 bucks. And then good ol' Agina. I'm sure he's got something important like the mirror. Or sword or something. So that's usually how it turns out, if I leave him to last. But, we will see very shortly here, won't we? Mm -hmm. That's a key. It's a pod. You know what? That's good to have, too. <laughs> now we've got either two or three pod small keys. I don't think we've got the big key just yet, right? Oh, we do. Got the big key and two small keys, so that might be a good play to do. Not that I'd particularly like doing it without the lamp, but uh, sometimes we don't have much of a choice, do we? Well, first things first, let's go finish off the backside of Skull Woods. So that is a dungeon we can now clear. Just be the two items, really. That first chest in the back half, and then... Mothula itself. Which with Fire Rod. Uh, yeah. Right. Going the wrong way there. With Fire Rod and a, a backup green potion shouldn't be much of a problem. Shouldn't be much of a problem. The keyword there. But we'll see how it goes. Thanks. <laughs> 
be a bit more frugal with my magic usage, but I don't really want to deal with that. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Put your butt down here, please. There. Easy piece. For 300 bucks. Alright. And another crystal. Alright. Okay. Two at 50 minutes and change. A full cleared skull wolves. Well, hmm. Doesn't leave us a whole lot of options here. We've got Pod, we've got Dark Cross, we've got Easter. Not exactly ideal. I think for now we will go Eastern, I think, because we can get hit we can hit everything but uh, Armos at this point, right? Because I don't have the big key. Yeah. Don't have the big key. Unfortunate. But, that's how it goes sometimes. will be, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Five items, and then once we get out of here, we can go to pod for whatever two small keys and the big key will earn us there. Probably about five or six, I would guess. Twenty bucks. What a good stuff. Hey, second sword, all right. That's better. Good, good, good. Hey, did it properly that time. Nice. Three bombs there, kind of worthless. Oh, I don't have the... Oh, right, I don't have the big key. <laughs> Terp. I was like, wait a minute. Yeah, I don't. Okay, so one more then that we can get to. This is still out of logic because there are no torches to light up. So without the lamp, what 
are we going to be finding here? Nothing! Fitty buckos. So, practically nothing there. We did get the second sword, which is nice. Not terribly cool and important. So I guess into pod we go. Two small keys and the big key. Let's see, that would be, let's see, one on the left. Uh, two on the right. The busted there, the center, the bottom center, and then one, two, three in the back. So that's like a good eight to nine. A good eight to nine. I'm perfectly good with grabbing. I'm gonna try to preserve. Try not to open the front door, rather, so... Hmm. It'll be a bit of a, a silly route to do through here, to do that, but... You know, I'd rather not go hunting for another pod small key if we can avoid it. A burrito! It's Ice Palace, thanks. Thanks for that. Well, the good news is with the bow, we don't need to do the potion glitch. Even though it's really easy to do, and actually kind of fun and cool. But, save that potion for another day. So that's probably Peg Cave. the Titans Mints. Okay. That's real nice. There, my goodness. All right, we are set for cash forever. Small key to Skull Woods. Oh boy. All right, we may as well just grab this one and go. We are out of small keys to pod. Oh, for a burrito. Thanks for that. Okay, well, that did get us. Did get us the Titans Mets, I guess. So that was important. So let us go now to. Hmm. Could do Ice Palace. But let's do Meyer Shed. We can get some info as well. 
quick two item check here. Let's see what medallion we need. Let's do a quick map check here. Alright, so now we've got. Okay, ice is a pendant. Blue pendant at that. We know five six are there, and Meyer is another crystal. <clears throat> Medallions. Ether. Good old vanilla ass ether for Meyer. And the boots in Meyer's shed. Amazing. Alright. Some more bombs. Okay. It's a valuable worthwhile check there. Um, hmm. I guess Bonk Rocks, right? We can do Bonk Rocks, we can do the rest of the overworld, dark overworld checks aside from the ones that we need the mirror for. Bonk Rocks is nice, quick, and easy here, and we can flute away to something else. Once so we're done. Oh, I guess we do have King's Tomb as well that we can get to. Oh, the other single rupee, thanks. Thanks for that. Okay, those are out of here. Let's head up to Dark Side at Death Mountain, and we can get info on a lot of different stuff here, actually, now. We can get the other medallion check, and we can check what we need to get into G Tower, and, well, if G Tower is two or less, we can go right in. Get a whole bunch more items. Yes, I should have considered not doing it that way. Well. Ah. Fuck that up every now and again. Alright, so Toon Super Benny here for in Hookshot Cave. We already know the floating island is a bust. Check the medallion, check G Tower. I don't know if I want G Tower to be open right now or not. I guess we do have all the gear to traverse it except for Samaria, right? Buckos. The compass. G Tower, boy. Boy, oh boy. Worthless. Let's see what we got here. End up with a vanilla ass quake? Yeah, we sure are. Alright. Information gained. Bombs. And then the red meringue. And then Kane O'Brien. Okay, that's Spike Cave, right? And a small key to Pod. Alright. Not a extremely thrilling hookshot cave there, but we'll allow it. Excuse me, sir. Spike Cave is going to be interesting. So it's not open. That means three crystals to enter. Okay, so we're one crystal short. Hmm, I don't know if I like that. <laughs> I really don't know if I like that. But I. I, I. Ooh, I hope I'm going to make this. Might be a small question mark, considering my one heart. Go, 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 go. Oh, come on! We were so close! 
Damn it! Oh, we were so close. Um, well, we could still grab it really quick. So I've got that magic potion. And we're right at the old man. I'd hate to leave this on its own and it turns out to be the lamp or something. God, lamp on Spiral Cave is such a cruel thing. Wouldn't be the first time it's happened to me, but... I also wouldn't mind seeing the lamp at this point. Troubles. No, I don't need those. I don't need the magic ones. Oh, those aren't magic ones. Never mind. Ah, it's a burrito. <laughs> T-Rock. Thanks, I guess. Thanks, I guess. For nothing. Spike cave. Alright. Uh, oops. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna away anyways. Uh, hmm. Well... Ice Palace is still a thing. We've got a few more dark overworld checks we can do. The Smith Chain, etc. Let's do those first before we go to ice. We did pick up another small key to pod, so that's two. Two more items we can grab at the very least. Smith, Purple Chest, Peg Cave, which I believe is going to be a... Sir. Which I believe is going to be a piece of heart if we interpreted that hint correctly. This is one of the locations that requires a hammer. But we'll do it anyways. It's a nice quick check and it might get us another heart container. If my count is accurate. Not even worth that. Not even worth that. Boo. Oh, crap. I don't have... I don't have the mirror. Ew. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be an ugly smith check. And an ugly purple chest, to consider. Do what we need to do, I guess. We really don't have a whole lot of options here. Ice would be the only, well, ice and a smaller bit of pod. Be the only other options here. Oh goody. Double my money back. Thanks, I guess. without the big key. Can't get into Mire or T-Rock or Swamp. No big key to Eastern means we're stuck there. There's only two more spots on the uh, pod we can get to. That extra small key. Which, technically speaking, we shouldn't need to do. Because if we open the front door, we'd be lacking that small key as well. So, it's probably going to be ice. Ice or, I suppose, ice or this uh, purple chest turn in, which would be wild if this actually led to something. But, we'll see. 
Rando's gonna rando, right? It's a small key! Castle Tower. Oh, that's right. Castle Tower. Do we have both of those? No, we've only got one. I think we only need one, though, right? For both items there. Ugh. Ew. Oh, I don't like that. But I guess we should probably do it. I always forget that's a spot in Key Sanity now. Ah! <laughs> Ew. Alright, we doing it. I guess we doing it. I guess we doing it. Oh, except the second one is in... Uh, the second one's in the dark maze. Which I don't think I can do without lamp. I could pull up a map and do it, probably, but uh, I really don't want to. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll see what this first one yields. And go from there. This is a nice, easy one to do. Another chest is in that dark maze. Oh my god, it's the lamp. <laughs> That's such a cruel place for the lamp to be. Oh no. Man. <laughs> Rando's gonna rando. I guess this is good since we're already up here. Yeah, and we'll do it. Oh, there's torches in here too. I didn't realize that. Oh, so we could have been up here. Could do it even without the lamp. Oh my god, the mirrors in here too? Oh, this fucking game. <laughs> oh, that's so bad. Such a bad spot for both of those to be. But all right. Okay. Mirror achieved. We can now go to... Oh, wait. We can't get into Mire, though, can we? Can't get into Mire, but now we can get into Desert. Uh, do we have the big key to Desert? We do not. Uh, but we can go to Swamp. We got the Swamp small key, and we don't technically need the big key to clear it, so... It's probably looking like a, a reasonable play at this point now. We're still fishing for some big keys, so... Eh, literally nothing. Alright, well... We have desert big key, do we? We don't. I don't exactly like this, but... <clears throat> beats go into ice. I can't believe Castle Tower had two important things. That's so stupid. That was stupid and I don't like it. But that's rando for you. Alright, checkerboard! A compass. No thanks. Let's see what desert holds. It'll be one, two, three, four items, I guess. Pretty easy, quick ones, too, so... Hope for the best here. We do get Desert Big Key in here, though. Could be another... Probably Crystal? First shield, hooray. Oops. Right. Oh, I don't have the small key either. Well, kind of limits to the effectiveness of this approach, doesn't it? Uh, all right. Um, small well, again.
We do have the Swamp Smokey, right? Before I go in there? I do. Okay. So this will be what? One, two, three, four, five, seven? Seven items we can get to? Maybe? Think about that. That I can count then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, nine items. Nine items. It's really the only one we can't get to is the big chest. So yeah, nine items in total. Small key to ice. Okay, well, we definitely have more than enough small keys to ice. So that might be a good idea to head to after this. Just I am loath to clear that one. Ten arrows! Wow, thanks. Wow, thanks. Time for a refill. Oh, shit, I didn't do the water thing. Duh. <laughs> Just hit the switch and left. Dingleberry. Side of swamp here. You know, lots of folks tend to skip it. I'm gonna take that risk and skip it, but I guess I'm too much of a coward to do that. 
All right, a bottle. It's okay, but not great. And 20 bucks. All right. Could have skipped it without issue, but uh, rando being rando means that if I had skipped it, probably would have been required. All right, well, no biggie. Just got four on the back side then, and we're out of here. I'm hoping that this is a crystal. Because if it is, that opens up G Tower for us. Um, good and or bad. We'd love to find Samaria before we go back up there, but... Well. Can't always get what we want. Can't. Okay. Literacy, 20 buckos. Hmm. A burrito, it's a desert. So we are still kind of in the dark about what the other two pendant dungeons are. Kinda of hoping it's T Rock for one of them so we don't have to go on a wild hunt for the ice rod. Buckos and a crystal. Okay, so G Tower is now open to us, and that's quite a few items. I mean, aside from it's the only thing that we couldn't get to now in G Tower would be Tile Room, which isn't necessarily a bad thing to skip at this point. So, if we're going to play the numbers... Well, first of all, let's head for Bombo's tablet, since we're literally right here. If we're going to play the numbers, we go up to G Tower. I feel like that's a good idea. Hey, Gabe, how you doing? Good to see ya. Uh, emulator or capture card? This is emulator, although I do have all of the equipment to do an actual capture. I just haven't got off my butt to, to set it up the rest of the way. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and go... I guess we'll do K45. Since we're sort of here. Since we sort of be in the neighborhood for this anyways... And then we head up to G Tower for... 26 items? Many items. Many, many items. 22 on... Oh, my face. Uh, 22 on the front side, and then, what, 3, 4 on the approach up to, uh... Jerk Wizard the second, right? Oh, hey. Sure, we'll take that in here. So a nice, smooth 11. 
All right. Let's head on up to G Tower. We'll be able to get in. Be able to beat Jerk Wizard. And then we just gotta track down three more crystals. For the face-off against Ganon. Uh, no, let's go this way. Oh, stupid. Wanted to look like Hollow Knight. Yes! Yes! When you set up a rando, there's like... Or a randomizer, excuse me. Um, there's tons of different sprites you can select from. I didn't take account, but it's got to be at least 100 by this point. <laughs> Wild. A wild number of sprites made by wildly talented people. They've done a very good job. They have done quite a good job with the artistry and such. Okay, so Gans Tower. Let's go check Ether Tab while we're up here too. Huh? It's probably looking at a smooth 26, maybe 27 items. Some of which I hope are some of the big keys that we're missing. Okay, excuse me. Alright, pop a quick portal here, go check Ether Tab. Is it one we need? Wire? Nah, not so much. Well, the only small keys we're looking for now is maybe a couple more for pod? And then just the big keys. Big keys to pod, to eastern. Ice we don't really need. Ice is a pendant, so we really don't need it. 27 items in total. G Tower. So we're going to be able to get 26 of them. Or no, less than that, actually, because we can't even go to the right side without Samaria. So we're probably looking at 22, 21 of 27 here. Which is okay. It's a good haul in and of itself. Ooh, we've got to find our way to the big chest as well. Remember how to get there. <laughs> okay, so there's 20 bucks on the torch, which we don't care about. There. Small key to this dungeon. Oh boy. Oh boy, thanks. Ouch. Ow! Damn it. Watched my backside there. Oh, I do have a fairy in a bottle. Alright, good. Tire waste. It's okay. Nothing. Nothing so far. Oh, well, alright. Good. Watch that first step. The number of small keys we have. It's probably a boom here. Hey, there's a big key to Eastern. Alright. That's one. Uh, alright, so can I... Ah, damn. We'll manage to get the yiggy. There we go. <laughs> I knew there was a way to do it. Wasn't sure what the magic tech was. Ah, oh, fuck. It. Damn it. <laughs> I know there's a way to do this one with the blue boomerang as well, but I guess we'll just do it this way. Oh, 
before I do this. So actually, if I think if I go through, I go through Ice Armos and I take that other stairway, I think that leads me up to the big chest, right? Alright, piece of candy, the cape, another piece of candy, alright. One off of another heart container, which at this point isn't really that terribly useful. But that's alright. Don't mind another one, a quick refill at a fortuitous time. items here, and I think we'll follow this all the way around. Five buckos, small key to the pod, okay, good. Fifty buckos, not so good. How many pod small keys do we have now? Two more? Yeah, we need one more. One more, and then we'll be good to go finish up pod. I believe this should take... Do I have bug net? I don't have bug net, do I? Yet. But here's the big chest. <laughs> Wanted to actually find that this time. 20 bucks! Oh boy. Oh, this recycle the things to make. You mean the music? Yeah, I put together a, a playlist with a whole bunch of music from a lot of different Zelda titles. And then I turned off the in-game music. I could listen to it. Um, gets the job done, I think. A little nice little variety. Oh, the game itself? No, no, no. This is uh, still standard Link to the Past. Well, I mean, that's aside from it being all randomized and, and stuff. my arrow count there on those fuckers. Alright, so with the five on right side that we can't get to, there's five more on the approach. Let's see, one, two, three, four that I know of. There's one item unaccounted for that I'm missing. Oh no, the torch item, that's right. Okay, so we're good. We're good, we've got them all. Ow, stop that. Hmm. 
having Samaria kind of sucks. Through some of the other rooms in kind of a stupid way. I guess we'll get a magic refill before we actually need it, though. Oh, that's a hole. <laughs> there we go. Just having Samaria to do that all in one go. I think this resets the room. I don't think I've ever had to deal with, deal with the falling bits of this platform for a long time here. If that even does fall. I'm not even sure that it does now. I am still kind of looking for those, aren't I? Ooh, let's see. Eh? Oh, perfect refill time there. Got popped there and sent back. Oops, that's too far. Last item we can get to. <laughs> it's only bombs, great. Well, hmm, I guess the rest of Eastern, we should have enough keys to do pod as well. But we're missing the medallions that we need for Meyer and T Rock. Good, good. Sega 2 taken care of. But, we're still missing three crystals to finish this off. So, 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 uh, I guess Pod. Oh, T Rock is the other, uh, non-green pendant. 
Thieves we can't do. Eastern we can do. Oh wait, do we have the big key to pod? I don't think we got that, do we? We do. We do. So we could do, go do pod in Eastern. We can check Sahasrilo, Sulurashrilo. See what he says about the green pendant. So we didn't do that earlier. Do pod since we know it's a crystal. Do we know it's- oh, wait. we don't know if the pod's a crystal. Uh, we can do eastern that we know is a crystal, so that'll be number four. Uh, ice is a pendant, T-rock is a pendant. What else don't we know about? I guess pod is the only one we don't know about? Oh, we don't know about desert. We can't do desert yet though, can we? No, no big key. Hmm. Shoot. Well, I guess at worst... Hmm. Oh shit, I was gonna check uh, Green Pendant first. Ran right past everything. I was thinking about something else. This will dictate whether or not I actually want to go back and beat up King Helmsor. If not, we can use that those two keys for other things. Uh, well, I mean, at least that's that's probably good, honestly. That's a green pendant, so we can take care of it, then we can turn the green pendant right away on our way out. So, maybe it's for the best anyways. since I only have two keys. Maybe use both of them on not the front door. So either way, I guess we're doing this twice. again. This will be one key, and the second one will be in the way- oh, actually, hold up a second. Uh, yeah, I'm still missing at least one more. Okay. Well, this is gonna be kind of stupid, but we're gonna do it anyway. So we'll use this one key up here for uh, the big chest. Use the second one on the back side to go beat up King Helmstor. Oh, there's three more doors we need to hit. Damn it. But maybe we'll get lucky and find another one in here. Uh, not that lucky, apparently. That's a small key to Hera. That's ugly. Shit. I guess we do still have ice as well. Since we're done with this rigmarole, we go over there, we get six, maybe seven items, I guess.
So finish up pod, mirror out, finish up eastern, turn in green pendant, head down to ice, I guess. Unless we find the big key to thieves in the interim. That would be really nice, because I think that would... No, we'd still need to find one more somewhere. Still, what, two items left in here? Alright. This one should be another heart container. No? Okay, I'm off count there. But, there's green pendant. Got two items left in eastern, and that'll be a 5 sixer crystal. And then we've got the pendant turn in for Astro. That's. Not a great amount of items left in this section, but... Yeah, we'll do what we can with this. Still kind of afraid that the, the big keys that we're looking for are probably in right side of G-Tower. Could mean another trip up the mountain! Oops, what am I doing? Not that way. Another trip up the mountain, and then a trip down the mountain to beat whatever dungeons I need to beat. Well, let's see. We'll have one more crystal here out of Eastern. Yes, sir. Okay, two for two. Nice. Uh, and then we need to find two more. Which won't be ice. I would love to do Thieves Town. And I guess Desert is the other one, too, so we need the big keys to Desert and Thieves Town, preferably. And there's Bombos. One of the medallions we don't need. The only medallion we don't need, in fact. So that's good, I guess. Doesn't lead us into, into Mire or T-Rock. Although I wouldn't mind going to Mire, so if we could find Ether, that'd be great. We do have the big... Oh, we don't have the big key to mine. Never mind, I don't want to go to mine. Yeah. The big key to desert, and I want the big key to thieves. That's what I'm looking for, really. And another sword wouldn't be bad, either, but that might be getting greedy. to be clever and set up the quick kill, but I was not good enough to do it. God. Oh my god, turn. Yikes. It's an ugly display, all for 50 buckos. But, crystal four. And it's a five-sixer, so whatever. 
<laughs> All right, so turn in green pendant and then I guess go to ice. I don't want to do that, but I guess we got it. Alright, what do we get for this? 20 bucks! <laughs> Gee, thanks. Gee, thanks for that. Damn it. Damn it, Sahash Rishwishwala. Assess our keys here. So we do have the big key, which we don't really even need. A couple small keys. Well, if and when we get Quake and Samaria, T-Rock is looking like a good idea, too. Mm. Mm. It's such a patchwork of big keys here. So what was I looking for? Thieves Town and Desert would be preferable? Maybe we'll find them both here. Wouldn't that be nice? That's a pretty good, pretty goodly amount in one place. Well, burrito isn't one of the ones we're looking for, though. Tasty as it would be. Tower of Keys and Tower of Hera. Oh, okay. Uh, so we might not need to go back up to Hera then. With that knowledge. That's good. Because I didn't want to go back up there anyways. Ice rod. Dope. Crap. Man, this seed has been a real stinker. Bombs. So if it ends up pushing me towards T-Rock regardless, I'm not going to be happy about that one. chances to find the keys that we want. Oh, crap, there's Quake. <laughs> ah, damn it. Ugh. Womp, womp, womp. It's not what we wanted to see. 
Well, if we find Samaria, I think that's gonna seal our fate here. No? Yeah. Okay, there's the desert big key. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. This could be a small problem. It's going to be warring between the big key to, to thieves or Samaria, really. Hmm. <clears throat> No, no, th th this'll still be completable, regardless of where it tries to put me. But I'd much rather be able to complete this without going to to T-Rock than, uh... Oops, what am I doing? I don't need to go this way. Without going to T-Rock than having to go to T-Rock. The fewer dungeons we actually need to go into, the better. But, as it stands right now, we need six crystals to go take out Ganon. We have four of them. And we could get the last two with Desert and uh, Thieves Town. We're just missing the big key to Thieves Town. Oh wait, I don't need to do the bomb jump here either. Good. Which would be real good. So if we find the, the big key to Thieves Town, then we're all set. And we can get the F out. Oh! Hey, look at that! We're out of here! <laughs> We're out of here, perfect. All right, so we don't need to complete ice because it's a pendant, and we don't care what's on the Master Sword pedestal. But now we have the big key to Thieves and Desert, we can go complete those two, get our last two crystals, and then go take on Ganon. That's what we gonna do. That's what we're gonna do right now. I'm a little sad that we don't have Silvers or a Tempered Sword, so that sucks. Um. But we've done it before with no silvers and only master swords, so I'm not, not too worried about it. It'll be a hell of a dumb fight, but better that than spending, you know, five, six, seven, eight minutes in a dungeon that we don't need to be in. <sighs> but alright, I guess we'll just check items on our way, since we're going to be pretty much nearby them anyways, at least in Thieves. Desert is kind of a crapshoot. Got four more items we can check here. I would prefer if if we're gonna find one between silvers and a tempered sword, I'd prefer the tempered sword. But even just having one would be good. One of those would be real nice. But we'll see what this rando sees fit to grant me. Probably nothing, knowing how mean spirited a rando can be. But, uh, you know, still got some time. Got some out of my way. I mean, it could certainly be crueler. Like, it could have shoved some stuff deep into Turtle Rock and made us go get it there, but at this point, we don't need anything else to beat the game. And that's good. And we do have a lot of health, which is also good. We do have blue mail, which is also good. I <laughs> have mushroom, great. Fetch quest. If we should bother going for that one. I guess we'll check this one over here, too, because it's just here. Just right here. The possibility of getting a better sword. Eh? Ah. Nope. <laughs> Alright. 
Alright, never mind. One more chance. More chance for the blind fight here, and I guess for uh, the landmo fight at desert too. Those will be the last ones, kind of on our way. Although I guess we'll be buying some potions anyway, so we got that mushroom to turn in. So we could do that. for bombs. Great. Thanks for that. Alright, well there's crystal five. Well, that's the other five, six. We could do the pyramid fairy check as well. That's gonna be kind of on the way. After we beat desert. Oh, did we? Of course we did. I'm on top of one of the rocks, aren't I? Oh, did we just manage? Yeah, we sure did. Great. Good shot. Alright, so one item off a of landmo here, two on the pyramid fairy, one on the mushroom turn in. And those are about all the items we're gonna be swinging close enough by to grab. If we don't get a sword or silvers by that point, it's just gonna be like big old shrug. I'm gonna beat the game. No problem. It'll just take a while. There's a sword! Alright, yeah, we're winning better now. <laughs> Thanks, Landmo. Incredible. There's Crystal Six. Alright, now I'm not so sure we even want to do Mushroom or Pyramid Fairy. There is the off chance that we could find Silvers. So maybe we do it anyways. Maybe we do it anyways and just roll the dice and hope for the best, right? Where's my mushroom? Right. Roll the dice, hope for the best. If we get silvers out of this, I'll be extremely happy. Like, please. Ah, nuts. Alright, well. The... Oh, I don't have green... Oh, I didn't... That's right, I used my green potion before. Well, we've got plenty of money. Let's buy three blue potions. Not that we're going to need that many. Especially since we just picked up Tempered Sword. Um, that's good there. Mushroom turn-in was literally nothing. 
now we just need to get up to Ganon, and we'll be done. So, this could have been a real shitter of a seed, but it's kind of redeemed itself at the end here. So we're looking at probably a 215, 212, 213 maybe? Maybe not even that much. Silverless? Yeah, probably like closer to a 210. We don't totally cock it up. Which would be nice. We'll just do the Pyramid Fairy checks right away. Maybe we'll get silvers. Vanilla silvers. Can you imagine? It'd be wild. It'd be wild, and I would be here for it. Certainly. But Ganon will be kind enough to tell us where the silvers are if we don't get them. <clears throat> there's a pretty good chance they're in the right side of G Tower that we couldn't get to anyway, so... Eh. I won't feel bad regardless of where they are. So... Burrito and... Oh my god, it's Vanilla Silvers! Amazing! Okay, cool. Yeah, now we're looking at an easy sub-210. Beautiful. Alright. Go cook some bacon. <laughs> Incredible. Just wild. Still an obnoxious amount of damage. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh crap! I don't have any fairies. Uh, I should have used a potion. Ah well. I forgot those still do three hearts with only blue nail. I ain't gonna mess around with this. <laughs> I still got bopped by that piece of shit. Ow. Alright, that should be enough. We'll give him one more bop just to be sure. Sick triple to, to open it up there. Nice. Good double double though. Alright, two oh eight forty four. Pretty good. Pretty good, considering, like, the mid-to-mid-late game was awful. <laughs> Alright, but, prepare to fast-forward.
what do we end up with? 208, 44. Had most of everything. Oh, forgot to mark that we had the cape. Never found Samaria. We never had to go into T-Rock, thankfully. Found the last two big keys we needed an ice palace. And most of the overworld was cleared. Never even went into Meyer or T-Rock. That's good. That feels good. Yeah, I guess that could have been a lot worse. 20844 isn't that. Considering it was a six crystal seed. Never check pedestal, so here we go. And a compass. <laughs> and a compass on pedestal. Hard pass. Hard pass. some stats here, then we'll call it we'll call it a day. Kind of like doing earlier streams on Saturday. Kind of like that. I think we'll maybe keep doing that for Grab Bag. It's like, if things run long, it doesn't matter so much. If things are normal time, then we've got plenty of evening time later on. It just seems to work out a whole lot better. First sword was really late too, yeah. Pretty early flute. Mirror was kinda late. Eh, sword kills doesn't matter so much. GT big key was pretty early as well. I think that was around the 25 minute mark. All those deaths except for one were intentional. Yeah, kind of a not great collection rate considering. But still not bad. 2844. 2844 for a, a six crystal key sanity. I'm be not necessarily proud, but satisfied. But satisfied. All right. Well, that'll do it for today. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CST. We're gonna go back to Noida again. I've been on a real big Noida kick recently. It's been the the past two, the the most recent two of our of our Sunday long plays. So we just want to keep going with that, I guess. Like that. That'll be the next. I think that'll be the next clear on the shelf. Will be Noida since we spent so much damn time on Spelunky Two. Time to give Noida its due again. Time to give Noida its due. Alright, well that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.